What's up guys? Welcome back to my channel. Episode 2 of Bell Pepper Hydroponics System. episode we try to uh, demonstrate to you how to sow how to transplant and then how to set up these bell peppers in hydroponic system well a lot of you guys are very excited because the pepper is very huge it is like an apple size wherein we can enjoy uh, 200 grams of bell peppers I also is very excited about what is uh, be th what will be the result of this one so I made the decision that I will make this or create this or set up this as simple as it is it's because all of you guys or most of you viewers are newbies in this channel now the objective of this setup is for you to relate okay this is a low cost but yet we will not somewhat sacrifice the growth sacrifice the product but still the plant the growth of the plant the performance of the plant are still there okay so objective of this is to create a simple hydroponic system that will uh, eventually inspire my viewers so I choose uh, the gravity type of irrigation or hydroponic system this is the gravity type that there is no pump there is no electricity all you need to do is to set up a pail of bucket and then uh, irrigation hose and then uh, it will run throughout all over and at the end so I will have to set up this because um, again uh, this is economically cheaper than the conventional hydroponic system so previous episode we demonstrate to you how to sow the seeds of this bell pepper and then afterwards after 25 days we transplanted it using cocoa, uh, cocoa peat and polyethylene bag okay so as I said this is very low cost so I bought polyethylene bag at the plant shop near us so I buy it at 10 pesos okay per bag so this this is very cheap so you guys idea that you can set up this as low low as it is okay you don't need to have uh, expend uh, thousand and thousand of pesos just to produce high grade or high quality bell peppers after two days of recovery from transplanting then we set up this one immediately straight from the sunlight okay so I choose to have this right at the center of this greenhouse because if I put them at the middle of the greenhouse then our lettuce will not receive enough sunlight so that's why this is the appropriate place okay uh, wherein they will not obstruct any of the sunlight every sunlight so but instead they will have or they will share sunlight every day and then yesterday I went to my friend silver greenhouse I purchased irrigation hose and drip uh, nipple drip for uh, the system so all right i bought a hook uh, drip hose and the nipple drip that we'll use for this system so all right guys we will set up the irrigation hose the nipple drip and then we will demonstrate to you how we will set up properly is not a uh, uh, disturbing the growth of the plant and the bell pepper hopefully after 60 days or 90 days we will produce our first batch of bell pepper red jet bell pepper okay let's go guys
Now this is the 40 liter, 40 liter pail. We're gonna recycle this one. We will put this one on the drip irrigation system, which we set up right. We will now attach the irrigation hose. Alright guys, we are done okay, with our drip irrigation system, with our bell peppers. The system is very nice, very simple. Try to look at this, okay? We attach already okay, the drip irrigation hose to the pail. This is a 40 liter pail. Okay, from this one down goes at the end of the system. Right? So what's next? We will try to put 40 liters water with with master blend of course the tomato uh, formula I'm using this one tomato formula is very easy and let's go <laughs> so take note before putting the water try to lock okay lock first so that the water will not come out Alright, I put only 20 liters that will be good for two days so I will no longer put more water because the water will not go back uh, inside the pail okay because this is traditionally uh, this is called gravity irrigation okay so traditionally in Philippines they use this outside the field and then they put up a higher ground or higher uh, setup uh, for about 2,000 liters of water and then once they turn it on it will not go back anymore so this one I have to choose or uh, I will put 20 liters for two days and then that's enough I will put it again okay so so that the nutrients will not be uh, Will not be sayang. <laughs> okay, so let's turn it on, guys. By the way guys, this is the first flower, look at that, red jet bell pepper, so I will remove this one or I will wait for this one to, either of these two will be uh, developing mature fruit, alright, and then we will remove this one, okay, either of the two, so that it will have a double way only <laughs> double way all right guys thank you for watching don't forget to like share and subscribe to my channel so that we can reach a hundred thousand and probably half million subscribers don't know okay because I have a goal uh, I will I will uh, use my YouTube uh, YouTube salary uh, to purchase a farm lot that will be our dream farm 
okay so i would like to uh, share to you my progress from the start from Kratky method we are now with a semi-commercial setup with uh, nft and this one is our latest project which is the bell peppers which i am very inspired by michael caballes of uh, agribusiness i watch agribusiness okay so stay tuned guys see you next week